I really love personality tests and Stephanie Rothstein, you should totally check out her website to support educators with using true colors. And it's at um, canwetalk.edu. And so with this, this kind of can help with different students when I'm kind of thinking about my child or a student in their room needs clean. If you have a yellow student, you need to be very direct and blunt. You need to kind of just tell them it's a mess. You're not getting friends over until it's cleaned up. Okay. If you kind of ask questions, they are always going to try to reason with you. And so again, you just want to kind of be direct and validate their feelings. The orange, they want affection and approval and it has to be fun. So you need to somehow make it a game for them to play and have fun and, and make it again kind of fun and dangle that carrot right in front of their, their little face. The green is they need calm and a general tone. So you might notice that a green feels very overwhelmed when they need to clean up their room. And so what you need to do is you need to kind of chunk up the task for them at hand. So maybe for them, it's like, okay, I want you to go put your clothes away and then come back and I'll tell you what's next. Go do this. And then I need you to do this. And then you kind of, again, just need to break it down for them when it comes to those tasks. Blues might need a break before they clean their room. So you might say like, okay, why don't you take some break and then we'll get started right after that. So when using kind of that room and that explanation, think about how in your classroom you can use those same things to motivate your students when giving feedback. So for example, the yellow, you might need to be a little bit more blunt and direct when you're giving feedback to them. Uh, your oranges, you need to make it a game. You need to make it fun. Your greens, you might need to chunk up your assignments or chunk up the feedback because hearing it all at once can be very overwhelming for them. Your blues, they might need a break before they get on to that next task, and that is okay. So again, think about how you can support your students with the same idea.